Hey guys, what's up? I'm Trevor. And I'm Sean. And together we're Vapertron. And today we have another juice from uh, Rock Vapor. Uh, we actually bought a few while we were down there. And this one is another one by U-Turn. They got 50, over 50 flavors down there, by the way, guys. Fifty, not 50 Looks like a lot more than 50. Over 50 brands, but 100, over 150 different flavors. Okay. It's like a vapor uh, bar at St. John's. Yeah. Kind of very busy while we were there, too. Oh, yeah. This one uh, is Melon Ice. And, of course, it has a lovely greenish label to go with the sort of greenish color juice. And this one is described on the website under product details. Melon ice brings cool, icy refreshment to the mild and crisp taste of sweet melon, often considered an unexpected favorite. Now, uh, this website that we're looking at this on uh, also has um, some uh, customer reviews, and one person said, I don't normally care for mint or menthol flavors, but this one is very nice and refreshing. Uh, later in the same description, uh, not Sorry, I'm just going to continue from where I left off. Uh, sweet melons with a cool, smooth, not harsh mint. So, apparently it's one, according to the, the uh, according to uh, what that one customer said, that uh, tends to uh, be nice for people who don't normally like mint. This is one I'm actually expecting to like more than Trevor, because I actually kind of like the uh, nice, cool vapes. Uh, Trevor has kind of lost his taste for uh, minty, cool, cold flavors, with like uh, really icy flavors. But then, the last one we did. Oh, sorry. oh, sorry, sorry. Unfortunately, my Cool Fire Four uh, bit dust, so we're using Sean's uh, Ely forty watt TC. Forty watt TC. We actually bit the dust in the last video. The screen gave out. Yep. And we're just uh, kind of uh, letting it dry out, hoping it's just some the liquid that Trevor spilt over it, some got into it or something. Almost a year out of that. It's not bad. Yeah. Nearly a year, if not a year. That shirt looks nice on you, by the way. Thank you. If it wasn't one of my favorites, I think you'd keep it. Isn't that the same shirt I wore last time we did a video? Mm hmm. Hmm. Cool. Trevor had a very lovely red shirt he was going to wear, and uh, unfortunately some coffee got spilled over it, so he borrowed mine, just so he'd look all neat and tidy. <laughs> we want to look professional for you guys. Well, not professional professional, but half decent. Don't overfold it, like I do all the time. Don't always do so. I won't be swinging it around inside it either, though. That's pure. That's a very clear juice. You can't really yeah, tell. Yeah, it's actually very clear. A lot more clear than I thought. It might just be the label making it look colored. I say it's probably good. Did it have the juice well? Did you put our numbers on just now? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I already did, but I'll just make sure. Yeah. There we go. Now. Uh, like I was saying, uh, this is one, in the last time that we did a U-turn juice, in our last video, uh, it was one that I was expecting to actually not like that much, and uh, it turned out I actually liked it quite a bit. Trevor's vaping on it right now, actually. This one. This is uh, Fruity Loops. Yeah. And uh, who knows, even though Trevor isn't expecting to like this one, maybe... It'll be one where he'll do a U-turn of his own after trying it, like I did with the Fruity Loops. <laughs> <laughs> sure she doesn't have power. I wonder if that's where they got the name. I have no idea. Yeah, it's in power mode. It's uh, at 30 watts, and it's reading on this at 0.32 ohms. So, let's give her a shot. Huh. Do you look disappointed? No, not at all. It's sort of a... Yeah, you get that uh, cooling sensation right off the bat. Oh. 
And on the exhale, you get a nice, uh, well, somewhat on the inhale, but more on the exhale, you get a nice uh, melony, sort of a honeydew melon, maybe. No, not a honeydew. Yeah, it's maybe a honeydew melon flavor. You already smelled it. Oh, we did a good one. <laughs> we skipped the smell. I can smell the minty. Mm. Whew. Oh, I can smell the, the melon and the mint. Not a smell of the juice. I smell that. Smell the nice <sighs> melon flavor. Yeah, I can do that. All right, let's give it a shot. It actually is quite nice. <clears throat> oh. Despite your growing dislike of uh, mint and menthol flavors, do you think this is one you'd enjoy? Should I take that as a no? That's Brent's. I don't know. <laughs> <coughs> I don't like it. No? Definitely not one you'd enjoy. No. It is one I would enjoy. And it is uh, a very light, not very harsh at all. A very nice, um, pleasant, minty freshness to it. So it's sort of a nice cooling sensation. And uh, the melon is certainly a nice, uh, a nice pleasant flavor. Uh, melon is not, it's not a really strong melon flavor, but then melon really is a very strong flavor anyway. So uh, the fact that it's not strong, it sort of adds to the realism of the flavor. Let me try again, actually. I think among the juices, once the juice gets really, you know, on the coils, mm -hmm. I think it would taste a bit better. Let me try again. Go ahead. A little tiny bit, because I can't really taste much. I'll turn up to 35 here. 35. Better that way? You know, I would use it, but not regularly. Not regularly. Yeah, I really prefer the uh, Fruit Loops. No, it's not because not putting down u turn because we just tried the other one and I really liked it. Oh yeah, I understand what you mean. It, it's more of a, a taste thing, basically, for you is what you're saying. No, it's, it's, it's not really man. to your this particular flavor is not really to your taste. Not a fan. Oh well, it's only our second u turn juice we tried, so hopefully the next. I juice. actually enjoy it quite a bit. I think oh. I'm going to be I'm going to be using that one in actually quite a bit. That's the one I'm going to start using regularly for a while. I think I... you, uh, if we uh, ever have this bottle on camera again in the future, don't be surprised if there's quite a bit gone. Um, we didn't tell the Nick content of this, by the way. Six. This is six milligram, and I believe the other one we did in our last video was as well. Yes, six milligram. So we went with six milligram this time. I don't think there was one we had three because they were out of six. Can't remember which flavor it was. That was the other brand name. That was the other brand? They got, like I said, they got over 50 different brand names over there, what they told me. And um, they got 150 different flavors. Yeah. And unfortunately, we made the mistake of uh, going in the day after your birthday. Oh, yeah. It's your birthday. Uh, going to Rock Vapor. They expect to get ID'd. Uh, because oh, yes. They do ID. Uh, expect to get ID'd, and um, uh, you know you'll get a free bottle of e-liquid, which is fantastic. At least as of the time we shoot this video, of course, uh, just like prices, uh, these things uh, may not be guaranteed to last. So who knows? They might find that to be more expensive than uh, it's worth. Oh yeah, the bottles of juice down there are uh, like I think uh, those bottles are like eleven bucks. They were about eleven ninety nine. Eleven ninety nine for Each. those bottles. So a very good price. I believe they told me nice they use. got they got a range between seven and twenty dollars. Twenty from just over seven to just over twenty one, I believe twenty one to twenty two, somewhere in that range. So you got a big exactly. range of e-liquid. Yeah, and a, a wide range of prices it's, as well. It's a vapor bar. <laughs> it's essentially a vapor bar. What which is, would be which is really cool here. Um, the vapor bars are cool. I've seen vapor yeah. bars. On like YouTube videos and stuff, and I always wanted one here. Now we got one here. They only opened like oh, at the time of this uh, time of this video, probably about three months ago. Yeah. So, and I really wish we had gone down and tried them out sooner. Uh, I would mention though, if you're a big fan of the live e juices, I didn't see any there. I might have just missed them, but as far as I know, they're not there. 
Uh, I didn't see any by Divine there either. They do have a huge selection, uh, but then uh, there are some uh, brands, of course, you know, if you're a huge fan of a specific brand, uh, you might be just going to the store you normally go to. But don't let that stop you. Please, by all means, there's lots of room in the local market for multiple businesses. So, you know, uh, and I would encourage anyone, try different brands, try different flavors. Don't stick to one thing, please. You will be hugely depriving yourself if you just stick to one brand, one flavor, and that's it. Okay? So, by all means, uh, definitely give Rock Vapor a try. Uh, see what it's like. See if there's something there that you enjoy. And uh, all the other stores around as well, incidentally. Yeah, there's a lot around. There's a lot here. It, it, it just recently got co like recently common. It's the vapor stores are beginning like Tim Hortons here in Canada. You know how many Tim Hortons are around? <laughs> like, for example, uh, down maybe, by... Maybe, maybe not quite that common, but yeah. Down, for example, down by another vapor local vapor shop, there is a Tim Hortons, a main location, and then there's a, they're just down the road, another Tim Hortons. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if vapor shops have gotten quite that common, but who knows? Maybe someday they will. I'm sure they will. I can easily see vaping overtaking cigarettes, especially with flavors like this out there and such a wide variety for such a wide variety of tastes. Uh, if you haven't yet found an e-juice that you like, definitely keep trying. There's literally between all the different vapor stores we have around here, there's literally hundreds and hundreds of different options for you. So please don't give up keep at it, you will find something that you enjoy. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment. And uh, back to the topic on hand, please, if you like melon at all, and you like a nice, refreshing, cooling vapor, give that a try. If, uh, if what I just said applies to you, this is definitely one you'll like. So, <clears throat> anything else you want to add? I'm going to say it again. Just like, comment, subscribe, and uh, put a, you know, and ask us anything you want. Yeah. If you want to try certain flavors, let us know. If you want to review certain products, let us know. If yeah. you want to anything, just let us know. And we will be happy, if at all possible, to uh, go ahead and do just that. Anyway, in the meantime, with another uh, really good vapor from U-Turn, this is Vapor Tron. Out.